Hello everyone, in this video we will discuss about nested structure in C programming. A nested structure in C is a structure within structure. One structure can be declared inside another structure in the same way structure members are declared inside a structure. C provides us the feature of nesting one structure within another structure by using which complex data types are created. For example, we may need to store the address of an entity employee in a structure. The attribute address may also have the subparts as street number, city, state, and PIN code. So to store the address of the employee, we need to store the address of the employee into a separate structure and nest the structure address into the structure employee. First of all, create the address structure. Stuck is a keyword and address is the name of the structure and address structure having three data members. Care city, int pin and care phone number. Now after that, create the employee structure, stuck employee and employee structure having two data members. The first one is the name and the second one is the address. To store the address of the employee, we need to store the address of the employee into a separate structure and nest the structure address into the structure employee. How to nest the structure address into the structure employee? With the stuck keyword. Stuck is a keyword. Address is the name of the structure. And add is a data member. Then after that inside the main function. Declare a structure type variable. Stuck is a keyword. Employee is the name of the structure and emp is the name of the structure variable and with printf function display the message enter employee information and with scanner function input the detail of the employee now if you want to assess the data members of a structure then use dot operator emp dot name then emp dot add dot city address may also have the subparts as city, pin, and phone number. Then ampersand emp.add.pin, emp.add.phone number. Then after that with printf function, display the detail of the employee onto the screen. With the help of dot operator, we can assess the data members of a structure. By default, all the data members of structure are public. Next is different ways of nesting a structure. The structure can be nested in two ways. The first way is by a separate structure and the second way is by embedded structure. In case of separate structure, we create two structure, but the dependent structure should be used inside the main structure as a member. For example, stuck date. Stuck is a keyword and date is a name of the structure and date structure having three data member dd mm and y y y y then after that create the another structure stuck is a keyword employee is the name of the structure and employee structure having three data member id name and date of joining in this case we have created two structure date and employee date is the dependent structure used inside the main structure as a member employee is a main structure and date is a dependent structure date of joining is a variable of type date and doj is used as a member in employee structure in this way, we can use date structure in many structures. Second one is nesting a structure by embedded structure. 
the embedded structure enable us to declare the structure inside the structure it require less line of code but it cannot be used in multiple data structures for example stuck employee employee is the name of the structure employee structure having two data members id and name now in this case employee is the outer structure then stuck date date structure define inside the outer structure employee and the date structure having three data member dd mm and yyyy then after that duj duj is a structure variable of date structure and emp1 is a structure variable of outer structure employee now how to assess nested structure we can assess the member of the nested structure by outer structure dot nested structure dot name of the member mp1 is a variable for outer structure dot duj is the variable for nested structure dot dd mm and yyyy are the members of a nested structure this is the way to assess the members of nested structure let's see the example for nested structure stuck employee employee is outer structure outer structure having two data members id and name and stuck date date is the inner structure and date structure having three data members dd mm and yyyy then duj duj is the variable of date structure and e1 is a variable for employee structure then inside the main function assess the data members of nested structure how to assess e1 dot id is equal to 101 id is a data member of employee structure out of then e1 dot name is equal to guri so name is a data member of outer structure assessing the members of nested structure dd mm and yyyy are the data members of nested structure how to assess data members of nested structure outer structure variable name dot nested structure variable name dot data member name even dot duj dot dd is equal to 10 even dot duj dot mm is equal to 11 even dot duj dot yyyy is equal to 2014 this is the way to assess the members of nested structure then after that with the help of printf function display the detail of the employee along with id name and date of joining With the help of stscpy function, we can copy the content of this string into name. If we want to use any string function in the program, then we have to include the header file hash include string dot h. Let's see the code for nested structure. First of all, create a outer structure. Stuck is the keyword and emp is the name of the structure an EMP structure having one data member that is ID. Then after that define the inner structure. Stuck is a keyword and date is the name of the inner structure. And date structure having two data member DD and M. Then declare structure variable of inner structure date 
then after that declare the variables for outer structure emp then after that inside the main function store the employee information e1 dot id is equal to 10 id is the data member of outer structure then assess the data members of inner structure date outer structure variable name dot inner structure variable name dot data member of inner structure then assign the value with the help of equal to operator e1 dot doj dot mm is equal to 12 is equal to 10 after that with the help of printf function display the detail of the employee onto the screen first of all with printf function display the id how to assess data members we can assess the data member with the help of dot operator even dot id then display the day of joining and month of joining with the help of printf function even dot doj dot dd then even dot doj dot mm finally run this code after the execution of this code detail of the employee is to be printed onto the screen. Okay.